Hello everyone. In this video, I show you how to deploy your ReactJS application to a free Google Firebase server. Firstly, you need to have a Google account and then navigate to consolefirebase.google.com. Then you need to create your Firebase project. Just create, uh, enter your project name. something like that and click continue click continue and select the account to if you want to configure Google, Google Analytics and wait until Google creates your project uh, as usual you if you want to deploy your ReactJS application you should have an application. I created a simple React.js application with welcome page, welcome to my React.js application and a link which leads to the Java master channel. And now I want to deploy it to the Firebase. My new project is ready. I click continue. Then I need to install a Firebase tools. I navigate to my terminal. I exit from the terminal uh, running my project, React.js application, and I paste npm install gfirebase tools. And waiting uh, until my Firebase tool is installed. If you have some error like uh, request uh, permission denied or something like that, try to run this install command from the sudo. Actually, it's a bad practice to run uh, npm install commands from the sudo, so make sure you have separate user if you use for example ubuntu make sure you have a separate user for the npm for safety and once my firebase tool is ready i need to log in to the firebase Click allow, uh, allow and yeah, you successfully log in through the CLI. After that, um, please make sure that you are located in my React.js application in the root of your project and uh, enter the Firebase init command. You see a list of selections you can uh, choose, but you need this uh, this one: hosting, configure and deploy Firebase hosting sites. Oops, I just uh, used run run command. Once you navigated with arrows. Uh, by, uh, to the hosting configure and deploy Firebase hosting sites, just please uh, space, uh, press space, and uh, then you selected uh, this uh, this selection. And now you see that uh, you need to select an option, use an existing project, create a new project, add Firebase uh, to an existing Google Platform project, and don't set up a default project. Uh, you have an existing project which you created previously and you can use it. Just select this one and you see uh, my React.js app. Uh, this is project I created recently. Just select this. What do you want to use as your public directory? So as we build 
uh, our React.js application, we need to say that our public directory will be built. It's uh, when we uh, run uh, React.js build, uh, all the sources of our application will be in the build directory. So we need to specify a not public uh, folder, but the build folder as our public directory. And uh, just just specify here build and click enter. Now it asks me if I want to use uh, configure a single page app. Uh, yes, I'm gonna uh, configure a single page app because React.js is a single page application. And yeah, we can just set up automatic builds and deploys with GitHub or we can uh, not set up it, uh, it uh, it's it's uh, the choice if you need it just place yes if you don't need it just place no so our firebase initialization is complete now we need to build our react.js application We need to wait some time before our npm builds uh, our project, and yeah, uh, the build folder is ready to be deployed. If you see this message, that means that uh, for now you did everything correct, and it's time to deploy your project to the Firebase. Please use Firebase deploy to deploy your project. And you need to wait some time until your project will be deployed to the Firebase. You can see that deploy is completed and you can see the hosting URL. Please navigate and let me, it doesn't want to navigate, let me just copy paste and navigate via the browser and you see that we successfully deployed our react.js application to the firebase and now you can share this link with your friends with your customers for demo purposes for example you can share this link all over internet and you can share the results of your development uh, for free Google uh, Firebase console uh, has a free plan which is suitable for the beginners. And for now you can just deploy your RegJS application and uh, you can be sure that it will be on the internet. So that's it for today guys. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and stay tuned. Goodbye.